Hey, what's up everyone? This is iPhone 8 back with a new video. Today on this video, I'm going to show you how to downgrade from iOS 9 beta 5 to iOS 8.4 so you can jailbreak your iDevice, guys. Um, as you can know that um, I recently updated um, my iPad mini with uh, iOS 9 beta 5. I liked it though but I want to keep my, my um, iPad for jailbreak so I can install Tweet and have fun a little bit you know with a jailbreak uh, device um, let me show you the, for the proof that I just um, I'm in the iOS 9 as you can see it says iOS 9 um, your software is up to date um, this is the iOS 9 beta 5 guys all right um, to start it, we have to have computer to uh, update to iOS, downgrade to iOS 8.4, not upgrade, okay? Um, so let's jump it to the computer right now and I will show you what we need uh, for the to downgrade to iOS 8.4. All right, so first of all, we need, uh, have to have iTunes on your, uh, your MacBook or your PC, Windows computer. Um, once you have the um, iTunes and you have to have one more thing, the 8.4 IPSW, I'm using my um, iPad mini. So this is the for uh, iPad mini, third generation, um, 8.4 IPSW. Um, you can download your IPSW by going to my website. Uh, there will be a link in the description. You can go. And once you go here, you're going to go to download IPSW and click on that. Once you click. Uh, you're gonna see right here 8.4 download links so you have to choose what device you have if you have suppose if you have a iPhone 5s you can just choose uh, what you know, what kind of carrier you have GSM or the CDM and it will down start downloading let me start it first um, you have to go to your iDevice and you have to hold um, hold the power button and the home button for the 10 second and lay off the power button and keep holding the home setting and it will pop up iTunes on your um, in your uh, PC okay so let me start it so you have to hold the power and the home button one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and let off the power button and keep holding the home button okay keep holding the home button and um, it will pop up uh, iTunes on your computer and it will say connecting to the server and it will say iTunes has detected an iPad in recovery mode you must restore this iPad before you can use the iTunes so you have to click OK uh, now you're gonna see like this uh, if you are running uh, Windows then you have to click shift and restore iPad um, if you are running a MacBook then you have to click option and restore iPad okay so I'm using MacBook so I'm just gonna click option and restore and it will pop up the new window and then you have to choose IPSW that you just download that's called iOS so I'm uh, using this one 8.4 and click restore and it will do their magic and I will just fast forward this it will take around three to five minutes so I'll be back So I just finished. Um, it just finished in the iTunes. So uh, you can close that iTunes, and then I will throw you to the my iPad now. Okay. So as you can see here, it's bo booting up uh, my iPad Mini right now. Um, it's in the Apple logo. As you can see here, is the progressing bar. Um, it will just rise slowly by the white dot right here. It will just go. Um, it will take a couple seconds um, don't worry I'll I will not fast forward about this I will just wait to, until it will done um, it, it took me a four minute to restore um, 
depend on internet speed I'm right now I'm getting kind of slow internet all right I don't know why I usually it will used to take me like three minutes but this time it took me four minutes four to five minutes all right so I think I'm almost here now um, they're just booting up right now totally booting up as you can see by the oh, okay um let me just set up right now okay all right go choose your Wi-Fi choose next and I'll just disable local service sorry about the landscaping sir guys uh, now you can restore from here um, if you have a, you can back restore from the iCloud and but I'm not gonna restore I'm just gonna set up as a new iPad then you skip this step um, do not use it and I think I have to agree the terms and a condition uh, I'll set up later set up later and don't add the passcode okay uh, use Siri do not send and get started BAM guys I'm right here okay I'm finally on the iOS 8.4 let me prove that I'm running iOS 8.4 by going to general and by updates and you will see right here it says iOS 8.4 software up to date so this is how you downgrade from iOS 9 if you like this video please hit that like button that will help me out a lot guys and do not forget to subscribe my channel for cool videos like this in the future and please share this video and I will catch you on next video guys peace